going back to New Zealand. Um, two days with family and then straight into camp with the football ferns. We're gonna spend some time in Auckland before we go to New Caledonia and uh, hope to qualify for the World Cup. So we've got a World Cup qualifying tournament against uh, the Pacific Island teams. Should be good. So stay tuned and uh, keep you updated. Check out this little foam rolling. Uh, what's it called? Hi. <laughs> is this a mountain face they have here? Oh, is this it? Japanese restaurant which had an epic sounding tofu curry or a tofu stir fry thing but it closed just as I got there so I had to get a I didn't have to I got a baguette falafel it was all right I feel like it had been sat there all day so not ideal um, but yeah step one's gone all right easy journey it's amazing flying over the cities at night just so many people, so many things, so much going on. The, like the way the cities just kind of <laughs> how they sit on the landscape it just reminds me of like the veins. If you zoom in on, or like a, the cells, you know, some kind of biology thing. Flying's cool. We're in a tiny little plane coming over, but I think the next one I'm flying to Hong Kong, so I imagine it'll be a bigger plane. And I think 48D, hopefully that's a window seat. Love a window seat. Anyway.
flight, 11 hour flight to Hong Kong. And then a one hour turnaround until I fly to Auckland. So I'm gonna be pushing it. Fingers crossed it works out. She met and I'm catching up with my dad and his partner Carolyn. Go have some food and enjoy the beautiful weather. I'm being home. Day one of Football Ferns Camp and today was awesome. 
It was really cool. We just spent the day together out at the beach in Murawai and um, just kind of talked about what's been happening and where we want to go from here as a group. And uh, yeah, we. Um, I don't want to talk too much about it because obviously it's a it's a private matter and it's something that as a team it's our our culture and our understanding of things but I feel like we're in a really good place to take steps forward and kind of show the world what we're about and uh, it's exciting. We got Tom Samani in charge who it's just, everything just kind of feels like a good fit at the moment and so tomorrow we're on the pitch for the first time for me in what's been months since been, uh, September? Oh. November I think since November last year so it's gonna be awesome just to be back with the New Zealand girls training in New Zealand beautiful day today might have caught a bit of sun um, but I'm still quite jet lagged, so I'm gonna hit the hay. Check this bed out. <laughs> it's so big. Um, but yeah, really looking forward to seeing what comes of this week. Just making it, making, making something. I don't know. <laughs> Too tired. I'll figure it out, and I'll hopefully keep you informed. Much love. Day two, Football Ferns Camp here in Auckland. This is the view. You can see the Harbour Bridge. And so, we've got a delivery. Number nine. Interesting, right? Check it out. Backpack. We got. Uh, maybe those are track pants. Ah. How cool is that? So we got just one training today, we're going to go meet with the New Zealand Football Board. Um, I think they're going to apologise for what's happened in the past and set some steps for how they're going to support us in the future. And uh, then crack into training, come back, lunch, and we have the afternoon off before having a team meeting this afternoon. Let's get at it. So, we are like day four, six, day six, I don't know, and we are leaving Auckland today, we've had about three training sessions here, nothing too crazy, um, just getting touches on the ball, getting used to being back together, and um, playing with all the girls, and packing up now because we are off to New Caledonia for the qualifiers, so, stay tuned. <laughs> 